Installing your ESA files into your software is very simple. Once you've started the download file process, it'll automatically download into your download folder. You're going to right click and say show in folder and it'll show you the zip file with the font that you've just purchased. Double click on that and it'll open up the ESA file and you're going to copy it. Once it's copied, you'll go into your C drive and you'll go to your program files 86 and you'll go down to the Wilcom file folder. Once you open the Wilcom file folder, simply open up the Hatch Embroidery software and you're going to see your user lettering folder. Once you've opened that, you're simply going to copy that ESA file directly into that folder. Now it's installed. All you have to do is restart your software and next time you go into it, ESA file will be there for you to use. You can also follow the same steps and download the PDF instructions which will show you how to install an ESA font within your software as well. These instructions will show you step by step how to put the ESA fonts into the proper file folder within your software.